Hello everyone. Imagine that you believe you have built the strongest, safest network for your company. You have told everyone that systems cannot be breached. But are you really sure? What vulnerabilities are you leaving behind? If someone got inside, what would happen next? A honey net helps you to answer this question. With the help of a honey net, you will watch a hacker move through a mirror image of your system and you will see where you went wrong and fix your mistakes long before your company loses anything valuable but what is a honey net that is the topic of today's video a honey net is a network setup with intentional vulnerabilities hosted on a decoy system to trap hackers the primary purpose of a honey net is to test network security and identify emerging threats that could potentially damage the business it consists of multiple vulnerable systems that are intentionally left unsecured and monitored to collect information about the behavior of cyber criminals let me put it this way to clear things up a honey net is a type of security mechanism used to detect and analyze cyber attacks malware and hacking methods therefore we can say honey net is specifically designed to invite hackers to attack the system so that security professionals could understand the tactics, techniques and processes of hackers, ultimately allowing them to enhance their security measures. Ok now the question is how does a honey net work? Well it works pretty simple, all you have to do is design a network by simulating the characteristics of a real network, making it seem like an easy target. Basically honey net is created in such a way that it acts as a fake network fooling potential attackers into believing that they are infiltrating a legitimate network. By doing this, HoneyNet diverts cyber criminals away from sensitive data and systems, and they spend their time and resources attacking the fake network instead of the real one. Ok now, as I said, these systems are intentionally left unguarded, so that they look vulnerable and enticing to hackers. These systems are also known as honeypots. They may include bait documents, fake login pages, or other enticing content that are likely to attract malicious actors. Once hackers gain access to the honey net, their activities are closely monitored by cybersecurity team to understand their hacking techniques. This monitoring is done using specialized tools that capture network traffic, log system activities, and record interactions with the decoy systems. This way HoneyNet buys the organization precious time to detect an ongoing attack and respond accordingly to safeguard its critical systems. The secret information collected from the HoneyNet helps cyber security professionals in developing better security measures and understanding emerging threats in the cyber security landscape. With collected information, organizations can effectively identify vulnerabilities in their networks, patch them and fortify their defenses against future attacks and also allows the organizations to stay a step ahead of cyber criminals and continuously improve their defense mechanisms. Banking sector often uses honey nets to protect its data and systems. Banks are frequent targets for cyber criminals due to the sensitive financial information they hold. Some banks use honey nets as part of their cyber security plan. For example, a bank creates a decoy database that appears to contain customer's account information but is actually fake. Cyber criminals who break into this database will reveal their tactics and techniques without causing any real damage. Ok, so in a nutshell, by deploying a honey net, organizations can proactively collect information about the latest attack techniques and vulnerabilities helping them to develop more robust defense mechanisms against potential threats. The deployment of HoneyNet hence plays a fundamental role in ensuring network security. Alright, so this wraps up today's video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.